Hello everybody, I am Molly West, and this is Hob once again. Now, I think we were about to climb right here. I think I was about to climb the wall. I cannot reach. Wall too high, unreachable, time to go up. And over. Yeah, there's a thing in my way. But I can jump over. And leap. Yeah, Assassin's Creed up in this bitch. Even though I don't really play Assassin's Creed much. I only played like two of the games and that was like Revelations and Brotherhood. And Assassin's Creed 3, which I didn't play much of. Though I did beat the game. Only playing it in like little installments back a long time ago, back when it first came out. Never have been much of an Assassin's Creed fan. Hmm. Okay. So what do I do with this block? What indeed do I do with this block? I did not want you to climb it. I wanted you to grab and pull it back a little. All right, that's good. Now maybe we can move it over to the left. Turn and, oh, I didn't want to climb it. Turn and face the block so you can grab it. There we go. That is what I wanted. Stop climbing on the block, grab it. That's the sword, grab the block. There. That's what I wanted. Now if I pull you over this way, I'm getting smashed between the wall and the block, but it doesn't matter, and all right. And from here, yeah, I made it, I am getting smart. The brain of my brain hole is working. Can I climb this wall? No, I cannot. Looked like a wall that I might be able to climb, but I guess it's not what I'm doing here. But there's a climbing wall, yeah. Why did you not jump? I pressed the jump button, and you ignored me, and ran off the edge like a dumbass, and now I'm all the way back here. Yay! All right, I want you to jump this time. There we go. See what happens when you actually obey my commands? It works out, you make it where you need to go, and you don't die needlessly. Oh yeah, suck it, tree. I got a sword and you don't. Hmm. Oh yay, checkpoint. And I got some weird crawly dudes there that are probably gonna try to kill me. That's what crawly dudes usually do. Unless I murder them first with my sword. Yeah, that is what a sword is for. It is for slaying your enemies. Oh, a wall. Eh. Bounce off of it, sword. I command you to bounce off of the wall for my amusement. Ha ha ha! Hmm, but seriously, how do I get through this wall? I know Opener Bot could just easily punch his way through it, and it would seem running at high speed face first into it is not the solution. Oh, we got some sort of dude who wants to break stuff. Are you like another Opener Bot trying to open something for me? Oh damn, that is not friendly. That is not a friendly friend, come on now. I cannot have you being unfriendly around these parts. That is not acceptable. But what is acceptable is your death. Yeah! Bleed, asshole! You bleed and die and I got two green things. What do those green things do? I know what they do. They are used to buying things. And that was English. English with Moldy West. The first language I ever spoke in my life. Don't believe me? Just look at how good my Englishing is. What are you holding behind, holding, holding me back from, door? I need time to think about what I say before I say it, clearly. Because I am apparently the stupidest piece of shit to walk the earth. Hmm. So, what do I do here? Not that, clearly, because I just died. Whee! All right. Running and jumping is the best solution to, what you, to things you don't know what to do with. 
don't know what it is, run and jump at it. Like this thing that I can't see here that obstructs my path. Probably a door. Doors tend to do that. They're very annoying. Hmm. I don't trust that falling dust that happened right here. Is there gonna be a rock or something that falls down on my head and murders me instantly? If that's the case, I probably shouldn't be standing right under it. Let's move on, shall we? Hmm. Oh, flying things. But I don't get to kill them. When do I get to kill them? I really want to kill them. Could I reassemble this broken ladder? That would probably be good. Be able to get out of this place once I get into it. Hmm. There seems to be an icon on this button that looks like a fist. Can I punch it? Can I punch it with my face by diving into it? Ah, punch it! I'm punching it! And I roll too. Why do you extend your arm like that when you roll? You try to punch it? Okay, a jumping attack. That's a thing. I wanted to kill that bat, but okay, it flew away. But I learned the jump attack in the process, so that's good. Hmm, nothing to jump on over here, it would seem. I don't want to go taking no leaps of faith, but I might have to. Now what exactly do we have here? Some kind of bronze steam engine? Yeah, let's go ahead and just stick your arm in there. Yeah, stick it in. Stick it in right there. That's always a good idea to stick your hand inside of a mysterious device that you don't know what it does. Put it in, boy! There we go. Oh god, it ripped my arm off. Eh. Hey, what are you doing? Alright, it put something new into my arm. Okay, let's put that back on my body. I kind of need it. There we go. My left arm is my best arm. Ooh, jackhammer hand. With that, I can break some serious nose. First armament. Oh, that's funny because it's an arm, am I right? Ah, but maybe I can activate this thing now. Hold Y. Booyah, motherfucker! Now I can break that wall. Jackhammer fist. Oh, yeah. Hmm. I'm assuming I jump this way. Yes, I do. Alright. Oh, damn. Don't want to fall. Oh, there's a ledge here. Gotta use the eyes. The eyes are very much needed in this situation to know where I am going. Hello, wall that I can easily break with my jackhammer fist! Ooh, yeah. That is a nice thing to have. I love fisting things. Oh, with a jackhammer fist. Like this thing that ain't gonna break. Oh, there it goes. Bats right off. Now, if only I could break the world around me. That's all I want to do. But if I wanted to do that, I'd go play Red Faction, but I don't want to play that game. That's my emergency game for when I don't have anything else to play. Will this break? Yes, it will. It is definitely a breakable wall. All right, A and Y, there we go. Punch down on the thing. That's what them fist icons are. It means I need to fist them. Go ahead and take that out of context, why don't you? And are you going to fist it? Might be a little too close. There we go. Fist that motherfucker. Uh oh, all right. For a second there, I thought I was going to have to fist it again. But what now? Am I free to leave? Am I free to go? Do I have the way to get out of here? Nope. Got to fist more things. Yeah. I like fisting. Let's take that out of context too, shall we? All right. So, got that ability. I like this sort of game where you explore, find new abilities to be able to progress. Sort of a Metroidvania style game. That's what I like. That's why I loved Hollow Knight. That's why I'm playing Valdis story. Hmm. Ooh, showing me some sort of thing in the ground. 
I saw it, but I never knew what it was for. Hmm. I don't understand what that means. But I do have an idea as to what I could do as soon as it lets me. Hmm. Yes, I get it. Just showing me the world. I know what the world looks like. You don't gotta show it to me! Oh, what's that? A new sword fragment? Oh, no, it's the map. I am now the proud owner of a map. Ain't that nice. But now I am going to do what I think will be the good thing to do. Baba Booey! Nope! That did not help. Maybe if I just fist this thing. Nope. No help there either. Hmm. Oh, I gotta fist this thing. Oh yeah, I missed. Oh yeah, I missed again. Well, come on, it needs a good fist and That did not work. Hmm. Perhaps it requires an ability I do not possess. Maybe I gotta go down this way to get that ability. But what's this? What is that? Something neat. I want it. Give it to me. I got that thing down there. Okay, you just smashed a butterfly and stuck it in your pocket. Not sure what good that does. But I'm going down here. I should not have jumped. Okay, just step over the edge. Probably gonna be a lethal mistake. Probably, indeed. There we go. Yes. Yes, indeed. A very lethal mistake. Knock, knock, bitches! Oh, yeah. Ain't nothing you can do to stop me now. What is this? Uh... I guess this is like a fast travel station or something. That would make sense. But where do I go from here? That is something I would very much like to know. Something that I need to know in order to progress with the game. Oh, there's a door I can, or a wall I can fist. Booyah, motherfucker. Hmm. But what is here? Is it another thing in need of a fisting? No, I just hit it X. Oh, there's that dragon-headed giraffe. Are you coming to lick my nipples again? Oh, I got a bunch of green stuff. Take that! I don't think he liked that, and it didn't do nothing to him. My sword just bounces off of him. But what if I fist this guy? Oh, yeah! Nothing happens. Nothing happens if I hit him with my sword or fist him. I see a breaky wall. But where do I lead? Oh, it's back here. Ooh, another breaky wall that opener bot refused to open for me. If I could just break it, there we go. Kinda hard to know when that's charged up when I can't see myself. Ooh, what do we have? What do we have? Come on, climb it, climb it, climb it good, you little red hood bastard. I assume your name is Hob because that is the name of the game. But I have no evidence to back that up. Other than the fact that the name of the game is Hob. Okay, so where am I now? Is this a place I've been before? Probably. What if I fist the purple goo? Oh yeah! Didn't do nothing. But there is a climby wall and a checkpoint here. That's nice. So where exactly on the map am I? I assume I'm that red dot. It's nice to play a game once again where I have a... Where the map actually has an icon that indicates me. Yotun seems to be lacking that sort of thing, making the map pretty damn confusing. And I assume these things act as treasure chests. And jumping from here might be a very bad idea. I've learned my lesson from jumping of high places before. What are you? Not friend, that's for sure. Spear dude. How do you like sword in your face? Come on, stab at me. You missed because you suck. You can't beat me. I am a Dark Souls veteran. I know how to dodge spear attacks. And that is definitely not how you do it. And I wanted to 
fished him, but I failed because he stabbed me with, my, with a spear. Hey, there's that thing up there. Up there, I saw that thing that I saw earlier that I when I was sitting on the thing in the first episode. At the end of it, I died. Yeah, he seems happy about it. All right, you son bitch, round two. I assume you haven't been healed, but I have. Oh yeah, the jackhammer fist breaks your body into un unidentifiable. That's the word I'm looking for. Unidentifiable parts and. These roots don't seem to like me getting near that flower bud that I want to kill! Ow. Should not do that again. Oh, God. Axe man. What do you want from me, Axe man? Do you want my blood? Because you ain't getting it. You get the jackhammer fist, bitch. Come on. I'm a fist, you good. But you just hit me real hard. But I didn't take any damage from getting hit. What? Pretty sure I'm supposed to get hurt when I get hit. Or did our attacks just bounce off of each other? Or is this game just broken in that aspect? Okay, don't grab the edge or anything. There we go. How many times did I try that? It took more attempts than I care to admit. And I cannot get through here. Way to waste my time, jumpy platforms. But I am up here now, so I guess it wasn't a total waste. But what is up here? Can Do I have like a spin attack I can use? Hold the button and no, no spin attack, but there is this thing. He will die. Well, he died. Booyah! Ooh, wasn't expecting that. I didn't realize this game had that happen in it. Explode your enemies into a bloody mess after you killed them. But I'm all out of time for this episode. I'm going to leave it right here. And thank you all so much for watching. And I hope you enjoyed watching. And I hope to see you again in the next one. Bye.